Klippet presenteras av Kalix Maskiner, Nyan, Exemptus Biluthyrning och Luleå Hamn. Facebook question with Brendan Shinneman. First of all, the most important question, how much do you bench and what's the flex on your stick? <laughs> ah, 225 pounds. Could do uh, pretty good reps at that. No, uh, I use uh, 82 flex, so. Uh, Håkan Sörlö says that TNT in all its glory, but what's your favorite ACDC song? Hmm, that's a tough one. Uh, Thunderstruck. I think it's a classic. Cassandra Schellström wants to know how do you best prepare for a game? Uh, I don't know, I usually like to have a nice nap in the afternoon. Um, just try not to think too much about the game beforehand and um, get a good warm up in. And you know, once we go out there uh, for the, the pre game warm up, I start thinking more and more about it and just try to, try to stay calm, try to stay relaxed. Robert Lundholm wants to know, have a metal Friday or country music Friday? Country music Friday for sure. Uh, Canadian boy, so I grew up around a lot of country music. Uh, Christopher Henriksson wants to know, do you have any special NHL player that you like to study to improve your own game? Um, I don't know, I think I still like to watch Cindy Crosby. I think he implements so many, so many good things, both with the puck and without it. So, um, it's one of the best skaters in the league. Um, sees the game, uh, unbelievable vision, so um, I like to watch him a lot, so. Svenna Nyström wants to know, do you own a snowmobile, and if so, what brand? I had a snowmobile, or my, my dad had one when I was growing up. Um, we used to like to get pulled on the sled behind it, so um, it was an old one. I don't even know, maybe a Yamaha or something, but a really old one, but uh, we, me and my, my sisters and my brother had a lot of good memories getting pulled behind the snowmobile. Marcus Huchta wants to know what was the biggest transition coming to Lulu? I don't know, not much yet, but uh, maybe it's going to be the, the close to 24 hours of darkness and uh, a lot of snow. Obviously, Vecco is a little bit different uh, climate, so maybe that'll be the biggest difference. But so far, um, it's been great. Uh, I've had a lot of fun. Uh, Pali Josefsson wants to know how you thought about coming to Luleå with the, all the history there. I thought it was going to be a blast. I was uh, super excited when I got the opportunity. Um, I think that just added a little bit of fuel to fuel to the you know excitement that I had coming. Was uh, now I got the chance to win the fans over. So um, yeah, um, I think it was, uh, it was a lot of fun coming here. I'm really excited to be here. Johanny Tyrvainen wants to know who would you bring to deserted island, Vilmos Gallo or Linus Fröberg? I gotta stick with my liony, Linus Froberg for sure. I don't know, I think I get pretty annoyed at Gallo fast, so uh, yeah, probably Froby. Roger Wallström wants to know what's your favorite meal that your mom used to make? Mm. Um, my mom makes a pretty good lasagna, so um, when we have that, uh, I think all the kids like it, so. Lars Passion wants to know what's your favorite spot back in the US and why? In the U.S. or Canada? Yeah. My favorite spot. Hmm. Um, I think probably one of the fav my favorite cities in Canada that I've been to is is Montreal. Um, it's got a lot of a lot of good history. Um, Montreal Canadiens are one of my favorite teams growing up, and uh, it's just a great city to go out and, and explore and sit on some patios. So. Hilda Espy wants to know what's the atmosphere like now when the crowd is back. Oh, it's awesome. I think we've. Uh, you know, they bring a ton of energy for us uh, every night and um, we've had sold out buildings so far and I think we have another one coming up Thursday so um, fans have been outstanding and um, I can't wait to keep playing in front of them. Philip Hallnor wants to know how has your time in Luleå been so far and what do you think about the city? I think it's great. Um, I've had a lot of fun. There's, uh, you know, we, the boys go out for lunch usually every day in different spots and um, you know, it was a little bit nicer weather. You walk around downtown and grab some fika, so um, it's nice right on the water as well. So we've, I've had a lot of fun. I really enjoy the city. Freik Wallin wants to know, when did uh, you realize you wanted to play in Luleå for the first time? Hmm. I think, honestly, right when I kind of left Sweden, um, I think Luleå was a spot that I really wanted to come to before there was even talk about it. So. Um, I always loved playing up here against Lulee. I always thought it was a great atmosphere. 
Uh, I always thought they had a great coaching style and, and, a, and a great system, and uh, they're they're a winning team every year that I've been here. So um, I think right when I left, I thought this would be a great spot to come. Alexander Rundlen wants to know: bar down or a five-hole? Got to go fancy bar down. <laughs> But Edlund, uh, if you could sign any player to Lulio, who would it be? Oh, that's, that's a tough question. Cindy. Yeah, Cindy Crosby, I don't know. Yeah. Simon Sundquist wants to know or says, you seem to have a very positive mindset and attitude. Where does that come from? I just like to be a fun, outgoing guy. I like to laugh and joke around, uh, especially with the guys. We have a lot of fun in the dressing room and a lot of fun on the ice. And um, Obviously, I'm super competitive uh, when it comes to game time. and uh, I take my profession and my passion for the sport very seriously. So um, sometimes it can look like uh, I might be a little bit of an angry person, but that's just my, my competitiveness coming out in the games. But other than that, I'm a pretty easygoing guy who likes to have fun and laugh. So yeah, it's, been, it's been great. Henrik Anderut wants to know who on the team would be most likely to get a lead role in a romantic comedy opposite Jennifer Aniston? Whew. That's a tough one. Who's a good looking guy? Or maybe we go with some guys without teeth. Maybe, uh, maybe Rasky. <laughs> Change it up a bit. <laughs> um, what's your favorite chant by the fans, by the way? Chicken Shinnaman? No. Oh, <laughs> Chicken Shinnaman. Yeah, I don't know. Um, yeah, I haven't heard it yet, so. Uh. I don't, I don't think we, we need to hear it anymore, but fans do a great job every night uh, cheering on the guys, so look forward to seeing that again.